Lesson learned. I cannot damage that whatever it was elemental with the shock. Instead, the shock healed it. So I now know for sure that uh, red damage numbers means I'm doing critical damage. And green ones mean I'm healing it. One thing I want to do though, uh, I wrote down that one. No, wait, it was not here. I wrote down that one. One message that uh, Big Statue Head said. Just quickly checking these walls. These are different kind of walls than usual. There are no no runes in here or something. Okay, it looks like an ice element out there. And in here... I wonder if there would be something... Okay, so he was here. Not in these ones. I don't think there would be a secret button in these ones, but I do have to check. I still think uh, that might come down. Um, so yes, I want to write down what the big statue heads are saying, but now I just have to find the one. Just have to find the one. was and I kind of want to open this one I wonder wonder will this actually take me somehow to that very hub I was uh, I was in because I kind of want to go there because I have an idea I have an idea about uh, about the elemental. Wait, there was something about duality and stuff. Right, it was right there. Okay. I'm not. I'm not talking about the one that wasn't. Uh, okay, but what was this? This was the. Okay. Finally understood the nature of his error. The gate was revealed not by the most complex, but the most balanced spell of them all. That might actually be. The spell I was using. Spell I was using already, but uh, where do I need to cast it? I have no idea. Okay, I think it was here, because this was the second time... No, it was not here. What the hell was it? There's two sides to everything. It was not there, because that was the... ...totally other side. Can't go any further in here. Ah, there. For every force, there is an opposing force. There are two sides to everything. This duality permeates the, permeates the whole universe. Can I... That's kind, of, that's kind of a long one. This duality permeates the whole universe. For every force, there is an opposing force. Force, there's an opposing force. I wonder how long notes I can type. For every force, there is an opposing force. There are two sides to everything. Two sides to everything. This 
this duality permeates the whole universe. I don't have to come back here when I need to think about this. So for every force, there is an opposing force. There are two sides to everything. This duality permeates everything. Okay, I'm just thinking there must be something that connects to a uh, connects to this one. Alright, that's what I want to do, and then I want to go to the hub, and because I think that I think that's elemental, I think it was an elemental, elemental, earth elemental, maybe, I think it, I think it uh, appeared when I went into that place. And uh, since I was healing it with shock, I'm thinking I can damage it with earth, but I'm not sure. It's kind of on the other end of it. But more importantly, I think I have a spell that deals with it. But let's see what this does. Okay. The hub. Ah, okay. Right, well that's... That's fantastic. That's perfect. Okay, but what I wanted to see was... These. So, scroll of shield. I know that. Scroll of ice shards. Water and... Uh, not going through it. Poison cloud. I think this would damage it. I think. And probably the poison bolt as well. But more importantly, since air magic was healing it. Of course, the option is that it was actually an air elemental. And that's why. But those leaves kind of threw me off. Maybe it was an air elemental and I was healing it with, uh, with its own element. What I'm really puzzled about was that the fire elementals, the big fireballs, they just blue on my face. I don't know. Forge field. Yeah, I, I kind of think that's the most balanced spell of them all. But this, this is what I was looking for. Shoots a ray that damages elementals. Dispel. I think I think that's a way to hurt it. I think. The problem is... The problem is to get... Uh, get concentration for... Uh, for Sun Guide Wolf. Because I don't think I'll be taking... I don't think I'll be taking Earth. I mean... Water. For uh, for Murzan, I might, but probably not. All right, that's pretty simple. So it's a so it's a Z. I will remember that from Zemov, maybe. Or oh, I will come back here and check it out. What did I have in? What did I have in there? Ah, oh, recipes. All right. Uh, do I need to carry these with me? Can I uh, can I keep them in a sack? Enter at your own risk. Why the hell am I carrying this note? Well, I will put it there for now. And then I have this, which I definitely don't need. Oh wait, there's space in here as well. You know what? I will put um, I will put miscellaneous notes here for now. So those are spells. Those are weapons. Uh, more weapons. I think food. Right. Bombs. Um, 
bones, the food, the skulls. I don't need to. Uh, definitely don't need the torches. So I had the torches here. I will keep one just in case uh, Morrison goes down or something. And uh, so I will carry that one. I'll store some food in here. I think I can leave some uh, some of these weapons behind, but I kind of wanted to check out. I wonder if I can damage them with blunt weapons when I can't damage them with uh, the two-handed sword. Can stay here. The throwing axes. Yeah, I think so. Uh, this one I might use eventually. This one I might use. It's kind of kind of odd to suddenly have so much food, and uh, of course I've been uh, for that reason I've been feeding the monitor. I'm sure some of you have been uh, paying close attention and wondering why the hell am I feeding the monitor? Just because I have so much food. Um. I was wondering about this weapon, the harpoon, and I actually want to check out the, ex the descriptions on all of these. The harpoon, um, or any reach weapon, I'm, I kind of want to test if um, if these work underwater. I'm not going to do it now, but I'm, I think it will actually work. This pole arm has two serrated prongs and is a common sight among the aquatic. Zarkton warriors, since it can be used comfortably both on dry land and while underwater, and it actually says it right there. Now I feel a little silly. I think those blue creatures that I also saw in the sewers and uh, killed couple by dropping on them, they are using this one, so maybe they are those Zarkton warriors? Okay, so that weapon can be used underwater. That's um, That goes to my pile of possible weapons I use likely weapons I'll use, if there's a big underwater area, for example. Alright, but let's look at these descriptions. Probably not the rock. A vicious little blade, tainted by unholy rites, so there's nothing special about that. Nothing special about the Warhammer. Nothing special about the Morning Star. Nothing special about the Great Axe. The most bloodthirsty of the fjord dwellers wore helmets crafted out of pyramid skulls. The master craftsmen who built the great pyramids in the Safai Desert wore these heavy chains around their necks. It is said that the chains were the source of their inhuman constitution. Safai Desert? So is that... Is that in the south? Because that's the one key to the puzzle. Then he looked at the path leading to the burning hot desert he called home in the in the cemetery. I'm still going to assume Safai Desert because it's desert, it's in the south. Pearl shield. The polished surface of this shield resembles that of a pearl. When it clenched to a fist, the reeds wrap around the wearer's hand tightly and improve its grip. This simple armband is commonly worn on the battlefield by professional warriors. Okay, I'm not going to read all of these aloud unless they are particularly interesting. Interesting in uh, providing some sort of lore about uh, land or something. Right, the fire shield. Longsword, a mighty weapon. The longsword is the weapon of choice for... They are Reonan. Dereran, 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 Dere, Dereran, 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 I don't know, Dereran Knights. It is renowned, renowned for its ability to impale even well-armored foes. This necklace, made out of ice lizard teeth, freezes everything it lays. Okay, this helm to skill for power, to grow, okay. Um, interesting. special about those. 
Alright, I still have a full pack of... Uh, full pack of... Food. I'm going to feed the toad tongue. To the minotaur, the barbarian. So... Right, they are not... They are not glass-based, they are race-based. The special effects from the food, that is. I'm still going to carry that. Um, I think I want to keep carrying the bow and arrow. The dart and the blowpipe... Um, nah. I think I will leave them, uh, leave them here for now. So we have more room for uh, for stuff. You carry those. Um, do I have an extra extra sack? I guess I kind of do with this one. So I can keep the power gems in a in a bag instead of taking my whole inventory. Alright, so that's good. Alright, I was checking. Checking the descriptions. I guess I should have read them while I had them. 200 sword, nothing special. The long sword was, had the same name, throwing axe. So nothing special in tones. Nothing special there? No. Still not sure which which gear everyone should be wearing. I haven't found anything uh, particularly special. So nothing on those ones, nothing special on the tribal ones. So no hints there, but I no no I uh, I can guess the guess the dispel if I get concentration for um, concentration for the alchemist. So the dispel. So I still have two places: Kilbridge Bog, of course. And the cemetery I can return from. So this is good. This is really good. I can also get now uh, from this one. Alright. The problem is I, I still can't cast the dispel. And I can't cast uh, poison cloud. Of course I can't. And this requires concentration 1. So I can't cast spells. So it's kind of useless for me to keep the lightning rod on you because I can't cast that one either. So I don't know. Well, keep it, keep it for now. All right. Well, let's let's go and do the House of Needles. Anyway, I just have to be have to be careful. First, this one. Just wonder where the where the elemental came from. Ow! When I pulled the other one, is it here already? I don't think it's here yet. It did appear when I pulled the other. 
I am the left eye. I saw where the meteor fell. I am the left left eye. I saw where the meteor fell. Okay, I capitalized the letters I think are important there. I have quite a, quite many of the black moss, which means I can uh, craft some shit. Where was the... I went, uh, I went some different way last time. Oh, hello. Right. There's one right there. Okay. No! It's a golden key. What the hell? Okay, interesting. No, actually... I have one, but do I want to use it? Do I want to use it here? Okay, one thing I want to do as well is uh, mark some save spots here. Uh, not the best one for it. There's one there. I think I can get to it from here. Potion of Resurrection? Restores death character to full health and energy. Wow. Wow. Can I craft that? There's one lever. Last time that's... Oh, there it is. There it is. There... Son of a bitch. Stay there. Jesus. Um. The road is not open yet. Ah, oh, it was right there, right? As you come here, right. No, I, I'm stuck here. Jesus, no. No, 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 
No! I didn't, I didn't mean to come here. I meant to... I meant to go in and trap it one more time. So annoying. So freaking annoying. I, I'm just waiting to... Well... I guess I might as well... Might as well just reload. Because that's that's what I will do when I die. I because I I don't save and reload like save scum in any way. I want to want to keep on going without that. But since in that spot I was going to do that anyway. But all the all the things I did were lost, of course. So now I know I will save that that particular switch. Out there in the back for the last. Not going to bother with the save things. Of course I missed the whole left eye thing as well. I kind of want to explore this place to the fullest before I unleash that unholy beast from hell. So I maybe want to check the golden key here. I am the left eye. I saw where the meteor fell. So somewhere is the right eye. That will tell me. So there's the golden key. Do I want to open it? Maybe. This potion of resurrection is... Um, I kind of hope I was... I would know. Maybe I know it, maybe I don't. Um, are there any other secrets in this place I want to check out? Any secret buttons? Just the golden key. something there. That's probably what will open with the golden key. Probably. Looks like rogue boots. Oh. I think I just took double damage there for absolutely no reason.
right. Yeah, now that I think of it, was that really worth it? Because I knew, I saw it was the rogue boots. I guess the protection, protection is okay, but... And of course, if I get the rogue set, I guess that's... That might make it worth it, maybe. Well, these shoes I definitely don't need. Yeah, yeah, I kinda wish I didn't do that, but... Well, I did it already. Almost forgot to pick that up. So all these roads are now open. I cannot have my mage die, so I will go... Yeah, I think it will... I will trap it. I need... I need to... I need to trap it outside. I do need to trap it outside. Ah. <laughs> oh, so funny. So that goes to the hop right. Uh, but wait, where's the... Where's the blue crystal? <laughs> I cannot let my mage die. Mage dies. I'm so good. I'm so, so good. <laughs> 